What's up, everybody? I'm back with another roller coaster review, and today is the review of Jolly Rancher Remix. And we got again on the Hershey Park grind. Uh, this coaster was released in 1994, and it is, of course, a Vacoma Boomerang coaster. So, yay! Woo! Says no one ever. Uh, this was my first ever Vacoma Boomerang, surprisingly. Um, I've ridden one SLC model as well at Mystery of the Adventure, so now I've ridden both of the cursed Vacoma models. But um, this one originally opened as Sidewinder, and then a few years ago it was refurbished with new restraints and, re -re and reopened with a new paint job, new theme, as Jolly Rancher Remix, and that's what I got to ride it as. So, And I've given fairly positive reviews of Hershey Park coasters up until this point, but that's going to change today, I, I, I guarantee it. So uh, let's get ready for this. I got some notes. Let's jump right into it. Uh, well, we're continuing on a positive note to start. Um, first, it has a very, very cool station, in my opinion. Uh, the lighted up Jolly Rancher looking things with the um, the cool lights and the music and, and um, stuff like that. Really, really, really good. Very inviting um, stuff there. So that, that, that made it a good start to the ride, for, for sure. Um, but of course, looks can only get you... Uh, so far, um, and as I noticed, that that's really true on this on this ride. So uh, you start, you know, you go up the first part backwards, and then you do the whole thing forwards, and then you do the whole thing backwards. Um, and you know, that's and the front part was okay. Um, I didn't think it was anything too spectacular. It, it, the conversions are cool. They weren't like as rough as I thought it was going to be, um, but it was definitely far from like super smooth. Um, but I didn't think it was anything horrible. It, I do, I do, I do want to point out um, the tunnel uh, that you go through, um, and it has like it's not just it's cool, like, cool lights in it and cool colors, um, but it also has like a heart, like a Jolly Rancher smell, like a very fruity smell to it. And that's really, really cool touch. Um, another touch on the theming. They did really well with the theming on this ride um, when they did the refurbishment. And uh, I really, really liked that. So um, that was really, really good. And then, but then, you know, you do the front part. Then you go up and you do it all again backwards. And the backwards part was what really got me. Um, I don't know what it is about it going backwards. It just was super disorienting. It was a lot rougher for some reason. Um, and I, I guess I just don't know if that was because we were going backwards the whole time. Um, so we didn't really ex expect that like, we couldn't really tell what was coming. We couldn't brace for it as much or just because that's how the ride runs going backwards. Um, but it just, I mean, the, the Cobra roll and the, the loops especially just felt super disorienting going backwards. Um, and I could feel it right off the top, right off the bat. Um, and maybe, maybe it was the fumes in the tunnel. Maybe that's the why you just get disoriented so much. But um, it was just super loopy and just a little, it, it became too much for me, uh, for, for sure. Um, this was the one ride in the park where I, I got off of it and I was just like, shit, dude, I am whooped. We may have been going a little too fast here. Um, yeah, it was just disorienting. So, you know, there you go, I, I guess. But, uh, I don't know. I mean, just walked off this one just really not enjoying it. Um, it, was, it was one of the few rides in the park where I just didn't really want to get back on at all. And... Um, you know, like I said, the front part wasn't horrible, but the back part wasn't um, much, much different either. It wasn't, was like not great. So, this is one of the few rides, like one of the only a couple of the coasters I just generally didn't like in the park, and um, this one was um, one of them. Um, and I, I did forget to mention at the beginning of the video, I know I'm reviewing Jolly Rancher Remix specifically here, but this is going to be more a quintessential overview of all Vacoma Boomerangs. 
they all have the same layout and they're all pretty much the same so I, if I do ever get on another one, which I probably will at some point in my life, but if I, when I do, I'm not going to um, review it. Um, but I will count it as a separate credit. But um, just because I feel like it's redundant to do multiple of them, um, you know, maybe maybe one day I'll do a more overview video, like a redo on like SLCs and boomerangs, and um, you know, give a, when I ride more of them because I've only also ridden one SLC, but. Uh, for now, that's what I'm going to be doing, um, and especially since this is also a more refurbished one, uh, I'm thinking it's going to be a better overview for all of them. So, and they want the better score, they're going to have to go with their newer editions. So, and that's the time for my final score. Final score for Jolly Rancher Remix. I got to give this one a five. I did not like this one at all. Um, so again, like I said, super disorienting, nauseating rough um really good theming and that's the only good thing about this ride really so and the fact that it's shorter because it ended quicker so but that's going to do it for this review if you've ever ridden jolly rancher remix or any other vacoma boomerang out there i'd like to know your thoughts on them in the comment section down below um you can give your full reviews and discussions down there about other ones that you've ridden I hope to, again, once like I said, get on more of them. I probably will, but I don't have as great motivation to do that now as I maybe had before. So, And that's going to do it again for this video. Stay tuned for other much more amazing content, including more uh, coaster reviews and other awesome stuff. I got four more from Hershey Park, I believe, so uh, expect those soon, And uh, until ne and, uh, as well as other awesome stuff. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.